Hello, I'm Harry Keynes for the Block Festival. The Block is a celebration of independent vision and artistic expression. This year's Block Festival will take place on Friday, September 28th and Saturday, September 29th in downtown Logan's Historic Theater District. At this time, I would like to introduce you to filmmaker Tyler Lawson. Tyler Larson. Hello, Tyler. Hi, how are you doing? I'm doing well. Tyler's film, Modern Shame will be playing at the Lyric Theater on Saturday at 5.30, I believe the time is, Tyler? I believe so, yes. 5.30. Uh, tell us a little bit about Modern Shame. Uh, what's it about and what was the motivation behind it? Modern Shame is about a, uh, it's about a woman whose life is ruined from a tweet that she sends out thinking it's a joke. Um, the story is really about um, someone getting found guilty in the court of public opinion. And... Um, it's just a, a common theme that we seem to be seeing uh, in today's society. Now, this is a subject that actually comes up quite a bit on the news. Was this uh, film at all uh, political when you were making it? No, I actually tried to leave my political opinion out of it and make it as ambiguous as possible. I didn't want to inject anything into it. I wanted to keep it... I wanted to... I want the audience to... Ambiguity it. would be yeah, a good word, yeah. yeah. Exactly. I want the audience to figure it out for themselves or make up their own opinion about it. I tried to lead myself out of this as much as possible. Uh, so, with this being a, a, a major subject, especially with social networking and, and the impact, uh, the question is, what's been some of the responses to the film so far? Do people think it's a comedy? Do they think it's a drama? That's actually kind of been the most interesting thing, is I think a lot of people walk out of the walk away from it not knowing exactly what to feel, whether it's something they're supposed to, they were supposed to laugh at, whether it's something that they were supposed to, to learn from, whether they, they didn't quite know what it was. And I'm hoping it doesn't, I don't want to necessarily confuse the audience, but I want it to at least spur some sort of, some, I want it to provoke some sort of thought, hopefully. So what has been some of the feedback so far? Um, I haven't gotten a whole lot of feedback from it quite yet. I haven't shown it to too many people. Uh, but the feedback so far has been relatively good. Um, so you'll be a little bit nervous going into this showing because yeah, yeah. I, I assume you'll be in the back of the theater trying to, to read the back of people's heads and, and, and seeing if they like it. Yeah, I think that's the part that I'm more nervous about. Is I'm just kind of, I'm really curious to see what a general audience walking into something that they, they, they don't know what they're walking into at all. I'm really curious to see what their opinion is of it. Will you stop them when the movie's over? Right? Will, will they be able to talk to the filmmaker? Uh, I'm hoping they'll come up to me and talk to me, but I might, might, might you know, start, uh, seek a couple of people out for their opinions. Yeah. Yeah, there's a little nervousness there, so you really want to get, this is going to be the first time you're really going to get an understanding of whether the message you put forth in the movie is, is going to be taken and accepted. Yes, absolutely. So, Excellent. Yeah. So, go ahead. I'm mostly excited, a little nervous, but mostly excited. Fantastic. Now, where did you film uh, Modern Shame at? I filmed it actually here in Logan. In Logan? Yeah. What were some of the shooting sites that you used? Um, well, I filmed kind of all over the place. I filmed in my house that I, that I have here, but we also filmed at a wonderful company here in Logan called uh, Maloof. They did make bedding products and stuff like that, and they were kind enough to let us film inside of their, inside of their building. Um, but also at the Ba Hotel over here. Um, wonderful small hotel. Yes. Where, uh, they're kind enough to let us use one of their rooms and uh, actually hold up one of our actors as well over there for the, for the evenings that she was shooting here. Now, some of your actors, I assume they were local also? Uh, yeah, so almost all of our cast is local with the exception of our, of our lead character. Uh, she, she's a wonderful actor from New York, uh, Kelsey Jones, and uh, did a fantastic job in this, in this piece, but uh, she was the only one that was not local. So local made, locally shot, and local talent. Yes, absolutely. Most of our, almost, I'm trying to think if there's any of our crew that was not from Logan, actually. Everyone was from Logan. Oh, there actually. you go. So when they're coming here, they're supporting local uh, artists as well. Yeah, absolutely. Well, that's the, the thing about The Block. So one final question for you. Uh, what do festivals like The Block mean to, uh, to young independent filmmakers like yourself that want to, to get your films out there and get it seen by as many people as possible, especially since you're local here to, to Cache Valley? Well, they mean a lot. Um, it's it's a great opportunity for everyone in the community to see what local filmmakers they have. Uh, it's a great opportunity to kind of bring to bring. It's a great opportunity to bring the whole community together. And um, I don't know, 
think that's about it. That's about it. Well, you know what? You're going to be here, and you're going to know some people that are going to be in the theater, and you're going to get to go up, and you're finally going to get the feedback on a story that I think is a fantastic subject, whether or not whether or not social networking is a, is a good thing or an ill in society. I'm personally looking forward to seeing the film as well. It's a subject that I'm, I'm very passionate about. Yeah, there's good and bad. <laughs> well, and, and I'm, I will offer you a, a very honest opinion. I'm sure I'm going to love it. Tyler Larson's film, Modern Shame, can be seen at the Lyric Theater Saturday at 5.30. For information about purchasing passes to see a full venue of events or to volunteer, please go to theblockfestival.org or check us out on Facebook and Instagram. With Tyler Lawson, for The Block, I am Harry Keynes.